Hello everyone, this is Just a Dad. Today I'm going to do an unboxing and kind of a review of this Mainstays Personal Blender. Okay, so let's open it up, see what we get. We get an instruction manual. We've got a lid. Okay, we've got the actual... There's the chopper, so those look really, really sharp. we have the base the electrical part so here we have the base so this is really plasticky feeling seems like a little fan possibly some cord storage if I wrapping it around but yeah these are made just for Walmart looks like just an on off button so you're gonna take the chopper line it up and snap it so the cord is not super long kind of like a pretty standard cord length okay so i've got it plugged in so if you don't get it like if you don't have it It'll even, it'll even turn if you don't have it locked in. <laughs> oh, wow. There's no safety on that. That thing turns even when you... Uh, I didn't think it would turn. And then when you get done with your drink, you take that off. And you put this... This is your lid. That's just a pretty standard. It does have a little vent hole. And it snaps. Okay, so I've got this. Beach. We're going to um, chop up some ice with it. I've got it plugged in. You know, it does have some rubber feet. So it's kind of stationary. Again, just be careful. If this thing's plugged in, um, you know, you can, don't, don't set that there. Because that will turn those blades. So make sure, any, the only time you, you put... Make sure this is on this thing before you ever put it in here. But really, it doesn't matter. So that, that turns. You can just kind of like set there. And it turns. But you definitely want to turn it and click it. But, um... Okay, so let's chop some ice. I've got this thing completely full of ice. We're going to put the chopping head on. It's got an O-ring. And again, that's the part. So... Might have it a little too full. Do you have to have some room for the blades? Yeah, there it goes. So I'm going to tighten this on. Not super tight, you know, just tight. And I'm going to put it on here. Then I'm going to turn it so it clicks. And now we're going to chop it. Now this button, it only works when you're pressing it in. So if I let go, it stops. Okay, so I'm going to have to kind of, it stopped chopping the ice. Hmm. So I think it works better when you got some liquid with it. If you're just wanting to chop up some ice, this is not what to use. So let's put some liquid with it. Okay, so I put some liquid with it. So we're going to simulate like a slushy I got in the picture. Ice, liquid, round two. It kind of like freezes it. Weird. Kind of like makes it a one big ice clump. Hmm. 
I mean, it's definitely slushy. Okay, let's dump it out and see how it did. Well, you know, yeah, I guess it was pretty well slushed up. It did, did have a couple, there are a couple big uh, ones in there still, but yeah. I'll have to play around with this some more. Um, personal blender. But now this is dishwasher save. This is dishwasher save. And again, you can put your uh, lid on and you can have your drink. Okay, so this time I got a bunch of liquid and just a, let's do just a little bit of ice. I bet it'll do a little better. Cyclone does a lot better. So yeah, the more liquid you have, the better. All right, let's see what this looks like. So we could, if we were happy with that drink, we could just put our lid on it, take this off, put this lid on it, but let's see what it looks like. Uh, hmm. I got some playing around to do with this thing, but just wanted to show you what it was all about. Again, this is the Mainstays Walmart personal uh, blender. I'll be doing some other videos on making some different drinks with it, but for now this was just an unboxing and kind of a setup and see how it does. So. If you could, please like and subscribe, and thank you for watching.